Hi guys. This morning we are going to do uh, pull-ups or lock-offs, wrist curls, and reverse banana boat slash Superman exercises. Um, the equipment we're going to need is a table or a desk uh, to do those pull-ups. And um, for the reverse curls, we're going to need weights or I'm going to use books today. Um, and then we won't need any equipment for the banana boat slash reverse supermans or whatever you want to call them. So I'm going to count to five and then you can get your stuff together and pause me and then we'll begin our exercises. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. All right. So for those pull-ups, we're going to, um, get underneath the table, lay underneath the table and with your head sticking out so that you can reach up and grab that edge of the table to do your pull-up. Um, I'm going to do kind of a combo of both. Um, because I can't quite sustain a lock off for that long. So, but then I'm going to do my pull up nice and, uh, controlled. Um, so you can make the pull up easier by lifting only your top half of your body and leaving your butt on the ground, or you can, um, use your knee, bend your knees like the girl in the top picture is doing, or the hardest way is to keep that whole body straight. So let's begin those. All right. So, yeah. These are pretty intensive. I'm going to try and keep my palms down, but it makes it much harder than if I'm making, keep them sideways. So the same thing for you guys. If you keep your palms down or facing away from you, going to make that exercise a lot harder and I'm starting to really fail on this exercise but just looked at the clock and we are almost over halfway done 20 seconds left so come on Ugh. yeah all right 10 more seconds come on we can do this So for the next exercise, we're going to do these reverse curls. I'm going to use books because it's going to kind of help me with my pinch strength training as well. But basically, you're going to hold your weights, palms down, and then lift them up as high as you can while keeping your forearms kind of level with the ground. Okay? We have five seconds left of this rest here. All right. This is kind of the opposite motion of wrist curls that we normally do. Kind of um, like when you're doing a bicep curl, you're typically in the curled motion. So, ooh, books also have are a little bit longer and so they have more weight on the end, which make them feel heavier. Ooh. That's pretty hard on my pinch training here. It's actually, that's what's feeling more than my wrist right now. So next time, on the next set, I might have to go back to actual dumbbells. All right. Okay, five more seconds left. We can do this. A couple more in. Come on. All right. So for our Brenda, reverse Supermans, there's a couple different ways to do this. But we're going to be basically on our backs. Um, the girl in the, to do a proper Superman, you're all the way up sitting on your butt with your um, lower back on the ground, but everything else raised. Legs raised, arms raised. Um, I can't do a full one, so I'm just going to try and get my shoulders off the ground as well as my legs off the ground. You can. So we're going to start those. Oops, I'm aligned the wrong way with my arms. Arms above the head. And you're kind of curling your body like a banana. Um, ways to make this harder. See, there's my toes. Um, ways to make this harder would be to try and rock. But I can't get that high. So I'm just going to work on this for right now. Promise you my toes are up. And then... If you're a paraplegic or something, you know, just try and get as much as your upper body off the ground and work as 
many of those abs that you might have left. Engage that core as much as you can. All right, 10 more seconds. Oh, I gotta rest my head. All right, come on. Oh, rest. And first set is done, guys. This is a hard one today, I think. But I think it's mostly because my lock off slash pull ups aren't that great. So, or those seem to be taxing the most out of me. I did club climbing last night, so I'm gonna use that as an excuse. But I probably shouldn't. Alright, ready? And begin. Notice this set. I'm keeping my butt on the ground because I'm pretty wiped. I can also make my palms go down and keep a better form this time. But I'm still tiring out. All right, 20 more seconds. Okay. All right. Don't know really where I am on weight wise. So I'm going to just try these five pound weights. Might be a little bit easy for me, but I also might fail. So we'll see how they go. But wrist curls next. I'll shake it out. Two, one. All right. Try to move those weights with just the wrists. Don't lift your arms. In fact, if you need to, you can rest your forearms on a table, the table that we just used for the pull-ups, and then just leave your wrist hanging off of it. Oh, okay. Gotta take a break. These are kind of heavy for me. I can feel it right in here. That top muscle there. All right, 15 more seconds. 10. Hmm. All right, five, come on, guys. All right. And back to our last exercise, the banana boats. Oh. I'm stretching out all those, shaking it out. Pretty, uh, feel pretty stiff from climbing last night, so it's a good little workout. 10 more seconds of this rest here. All right, get in position and begin. Ooh. Okay. Oh, this one's hard too for me. Who am I kidding? They're all hard for me. That's why I'm doing these. Twenty more seconds, guys. We're almost done with our workout for today. Ten more seconds. Come on. Nice job, everyone. See you tomorrow. 
then we'll have made it through a whole week.